Okay. So, hi kids. Assalamualaikum and a very good morning. So, welcome back to our fifth online classroom. So, for today's lesson, we are going to focus on grammar. So, uh, it's going to be... Uh, we are going to focus on question. Do you like this or these? Huh? Um, so, this is the chapter of Get Dressed. Uh, and the topic is, do you like this or these? So, if you have your Super Minds book together with you, I want you to open page 83. Okay? Now... Let us do some revision before, before we proceed with the lesson. Okay, if you still remember our last week lesson, okay, uh, jeans, okay, try to uh, recall it back, okay, jeans. Okay, next we have sweater, uh, and then we have jacket, next we have skirt, and number five we have shorts, okay, next we have cap. And then shoes, and then socks, t-shirt, and the last one is trousers, okay? So, uh, make sure by this week, you've already um, remember, you've already memorized all these 10 words. Okay, now, uh, today you are going to learn on making short question you are going to make your own short question starting by using the word do you okay do you which in bahasa means adakah anda okay do you adakah anda okay we uh whenever that you have a do you question so the answer usually it will be a positive or negative answers yeah so let us go through a positive answers okay for positive answers usually we are going to answer yes i do okay do you adakah anda yes i do yes i do okay so it means that you have it or you like it okay or you like it okay yes okay next yeah next okay if your answer is negative yeah your answer is negative okay usually okay uh, at least for this lesson you're going to answer by using the word uh, by using the sentence no i don't no i don't yeah no i don't no i don't i don't like it no i don't okay uh, if you uh, if you realize okay when you ask questions you start with a word do right here you start with a word do okay when you want to answer the question do yeah you will put you, you will put the word do at the back here do you yes i do this is for the negative how about for the negative negative don't okay don't is okay this is a short form for do not yeah don't do not so do is at the back do not no i don't okay next let us go to the word this or these this or these okay so um as I've told you before, okay, for this lesson, you are going to start a question with the word do you like? Adakah anda suka? Do you like? Okay, let's say your noun, yeah, let's say your thing is hat, okay, hat. Do you like? Okay, hat. Okay, hat is singular, only one, yeah. Hat is singular, there is only one hat. Yeah, one, yeah, one, only one thing. So, if you have a singular noun here, yeah, you are going to use the word this, this, T-H-I-S, this, okay? Do, do you like this hat? And don't forget to write down the question mark, okay? Okay, let's say, let's say, let's say you have... Uh, the plural word or the plural noun. Oh yeah, before that. Whenever that you've got, okay, uh, 
when you want to write a complete sentence, make sure you write down, do you like this hat? And the question mark. This is how you write a full sentence, a full question. Okay, this is how you write it. Yeah, how you write it. Okay, next. Okay, let us focus on the second one, which is the plural form. Yeah, for the plural noun. Okay, let's say we have the word shoes. So shoes, okay, shoes, the word shoes is plural. Okay, plural means more than one. Yeah, it is more than one, two and more. Okay, so whenever you have the plural noun, you are going to use the word these. T H E S E these, okay, yeah. So uh, same like the first one. Okay, we start our sentence with "Do you like? Do you like?" And then you write down the word "these shoes," and don't forget to write down the question mark. Okay, so. Please listen to the stress, yeah? To the to the word stress. This. Okay? This. This. But this one, this. It's a little bit longer than the first one, yeah? A longer. This. Do you like this hat? Do you like these shoes? Okay? So now, let us go through one by one, okay? Singular or plural. Okay, for jeans, okay? Jeans is considered as plural because there is an S. Okay, S at the back, plural. Okay? I'm talking about the word, okay? Uh, when it comes to a pair of jeans, it is something else. But today, we are going to focus on jeans. Okay, jeans. Okay, why jeans? Because you have the right and the left legs over there. Okay? What about sweater? Sweater is singular. Okay? Jacket. Yes, jacket is singular. Very good. Okay, next we go to the skirt. Skirt is singular. Okay, what about shorts? Okay, obviously there's an S over there. Okay? So, shorts is considered as plural. Okay, what about the word cap? Cap is singular. Okay, that yeah. end. Okay, cap is singular, and then we and then we have shoes. Okay, obviously there are e s to the end of the word. No s. Okay, you have s. Okay, s shoes. Okay, an s. There's an s there. Shoes. Okay, shoes. The word shoes is plural. What about socks? Okay, we have s there. Okay, we have an s there, so it is plural. T-shirt. Okay, obviously t-shirt is singular. Okay, trousers. Okay, trousers, same goes with jeans. Trousers, okay, the word trousers is plural. Okay, now, let us uh, listen and say, okay. I want you to listen carefully to the word this and these, okay. Listen and say together with uh, the audio, yeah. Students book, page 83. Two, listen and say. Do you like this hat? Yes, I do. Do you like these shoes? No, I don't. Okay, so uh, let us listen again, yeah? Okay, let us listen again. Okay, you listen and say together. Students' book, page eighty-three. Two, listen and say. Do you like this hat? Yes, I do. Do you like these shoes? No, I don't. Okay. Do you like this hat? Yes, I do. Okay, hat. Okay, this is a new word for you. Okay, this is a new word for you. Hat. Okay, this is a hat. 
Okay, it's a little bit different. Okay, it's a little bit different um, to uh, cap. Yeah, it's a little bit different to cap. Okay, do you like these shoes? This and these. These shoes? No, I don't. Okay, now I want you to look at the pictures and draw lines. Okay, uh, for this case, you don't have to draw lines in your book, but I want you to try to listen and try to pick. Okay, try to choose which one is the answer. Okay, uh, you must you must try to look for the question and the answer for each picture. Students' book, page 83. 1. Look at the pictures and draw lines. Then listen and check. 1. Do you like this t-shirt? No, I don't. 2. Do you like these shoes? Yes, I do. Good job, yeah, good job. Okay, now, okay, now let us look at, uh, let us go through one by one, okay, for picture one. Okay, listen carefully for picture one. Students' book, page 83. One. Look at the pictures and draw lines. Then listen and check. 1. Do you like this t-shirt? No, I don't. Okay, number 1. Do you like this t-shirt? Okay, so the answer is, do you like this t-shirt? No, I don't. Okay, no, I don't. Okay, now let us, look, let us listen to picture number 2. Two. Do you like these shoes? Yes, I do. So, do you like these shoes? Do you like these shoes? So, this is the answer. Do you like these shoes? Okay. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. So, these are the questions and the answers for picture number one and picture number two. Okay, now let us go to our exercise. Okay, I want you to look at the closest ask and answer. Okay, if you have your MCO's exercise book together with you, I want you to write down your answer in the book. Okay, you don't have to draw. You don't have to draw the pictures. You just write down the answer. Just write down number one. Okay, I give you the example. I give you the example. You write down number one. Okay, okay. So your questions, okay, your 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 questions will be the same, but your answer there will be two. Uh, there will be two different answers. Dep uh, it is depending on you. If you like it, you can answer it positively. If you don't like it, you can answer negatively. Okay. Okay, number one, you can just write down, do you, do you like this hat? This hat, because there's only one hat. There's only one hat. So you write down, do you like this hat? Do you like this hat? If you like it, you answer, yes, I do. Okay? If you don't like it, you answer, no, I don't. You just have to choose one answer. Okay, write down one question and one answer for each picture. Okay, as usual, you can just uh, click on the pause button on the video and do and finish up the exercise. Okay, okay. So now, now I'm going to go through the answer. Okay, once you've done once you've done your uh, once you've done answering the uh, writing the questions and the answers in your book okay you can you can uh, click on the uh, play button yeah you can click on the play button again okay now let us go through the answer one by one okay okay for number one and number two okay we have the same question okay because both of both pictures okay both pictures are hats okay 
So you can write down, do you like this hat? Okay, because there's only one hat in each picture. One uh, number, picture one is one hat and picture two is one hat. So the question is, do you like this hat? So what about the answer? So the answer, okay, you can write down, yes, I do or no, I don't. It's depending on you. Okay, it is depending on you whether you want to answer yes, I do or no, I don't. Okay, let us look at questions, uh, picture number three and four. Okay, picture number three and four. Okay, both pictures are shoes. Okay, shoes, plural. So the question must be, do you like these shoes? Do you like these shoes? Okay, so for the answer, you can write down, yes, I do, or no, I don't. Okay, uh, picture number five and picture number six. Yeah, picture number five and picture number six. Okay, obviously it is singular. Okay, jacket, singular, only one. Yeah? There's only one picture, uh, one uh, jacket in each picture. So, do you like this jacket? Do you like this jacket? Okay. And picture number seven and picture number eight, okay? Both pictures are trousers. So, trousers, okay? The word trousers is singular. So, do you like these trousers? Okay, do you like these trousers? So, you can answer yes, I do, or no, I don't. So, if you've got all correct, okay, I want you to mark, okay, I want you to mark your uh question and your answers okay if your uh you can get your mom's and your dad's help okay ask them to help and to mark your um work okay or you can do it by yourself okay it's okay anything will do okay so uh after this okay so this is uh this is going to be the end of our lesson for today uh, so after this, I'm going to give uh, the assignment. Okay, I'm going to uh, give some exercises. Okay, I'm going to give some exercises. Okay, um, via quizzes. So uh, as usual, you have to uh, go to your Google Classroom. Okay, I'll assign your. I'll assign the work. I'll assign uh, the homework in your Google Classroom. Okay, you just click there, and uh, the link will bring you to the quizzes. Okay, so that's all for today. Okay, so uh, the quotes for today is mistakes are proof that you are trying. So it's okay for you to make mistakes. Okay. Because it shows that you are trying. So never stop trying. Keep on doing, okay? Practice makes perfect, okay? So, it's okay to make mistakes. So, that's all for today. So, stay at home and stay safe, okay? So, uh, happy breakfasting, Ramadan Karim. Okay, that's all for today. Okay, bye. Assalamualaikum.